Here's another example that comes from a philosophical uh, problem, philosophical context. Determinism is the view that everything that happens is fully determined by the laws of nature and the way the world was long before we were born. Either determinism is false or humans have no free will. Humans do have free will thus determinism is false. Okay now the thus is a pretty good indicator. The thus tells us thus is like therefore. It tells us that there is a conclusion following it. Okay so we now know that we have we now have the conclusion here that is that determinism is false. So let us copy it over and we will just leave it here as the conclusion. And we'll make it into a sentence in English. Actually, put a capital at the beginning. So now we know that that's the conclusion. Now, let's find the premises. Okay. Now, we start at the top. Determinism is the view that everything that happens is fully determined by the laws of nature and the way the world was long before we were born. Now, that sounds like a definition of determinism. Maybe that's a premise. So let's think of that might be a premise, maybe, maybe not. Uh, either determinism is false or humans have no free will. And humans don't have, now those sound like they're probably two premises over here. And then let's, we'll try reconstructing it this way and see what we get. Okay, and now let's see if this is it works this way. Determinism is the view that everything that happens is fully determined by the laws of nature and the way the world was long before we were born. Two, either determinism is false or humans have no free will. Humans have no free will, therefore determinism, determinism is false. Okay, that's kind of interesting. But you know something? I'm really not sure that that first thing is required. That is, it's a nice definition of determinism. It tells us what everything's about, but I think that that conclusion really follows from 2 and 3. So I think another way, and perhaps a better way of reconstructing the argument, is taking that first definition of determinism out and just leaving the argument formulated in this way. Either determinism is false or humans have no free will. Humans do not have free will. Therefore, determinism is false. And it's an important lesson that we learned. That is, sometimes there are things that look like they may be premises, but they really are not premises in the argument.